Hey, hi, hello, um, and welcome back to my channel. Sorry, it looked like I lagged a little bit when I came on, so it got my attention. Uh, my name is Tanya or Titanium Built, whichever you want to call me. I don't prefer one over the other. This is going to be our continued um, coverage of the Idaho Four murders. We have talked about Olivia Gonzalez, which is Kaylee Gonzalez's sister, her older sister, on this channel before, but we've never really talked about her or discussed her younger sister, Autumn. Autumn is Kaylee's younger sister, like I said, and she has a little baby girl named um, Phoebe. It's out there already, so it's not like I am the first person to say this little girl's name. She has a dedicated TikTok page dedicated to the both of them. So there is a girl, though, that is in fact 14 years old, so please don't send any hate to this girl. But she is named in this TikTok that I'm going to show you from Olivia's, I'm sorry, it's Autumn, which is Kaylee's sister. I was getting all of the sisters mixed up. Um, but it, that's why I'm putting this video out because it is out there. I feel for Kaylee's sister. I feel for Autumn. She should not have to be dealing with somebody impersonating her while she's trying to take care of a baby, while she's trying to grieve the death of her sister. So I just wanted to bring this TikTok to your attention and get your guys' point of view and your thoughts on it. So let me know in the comments below what you guys think and I'll play it for you now so you can hear it right out of her mouth. Hi guys. Oh god. Sorry, this is literally so awkward. I never make videos talking. But basically there's a bunch of accounts impersonating me. Well, it's it's one girl. I know exactly who it is. Her name's Madison Dilly. She's like 14. And I know this because she has photos of me and my daughter in her school locker. And girls from her school has reached out to me and like told me about it. it proved everything. The police won't do anything about it unless I know, like, her birthday and all this personal information. And it's like, how am I supposed to know this about her? She tells people that my daughter is her daughter, and she asks people to call her Autumn and stuff. Like, really? But, yes. So, all those fake accounts, like, 99.9% .9 of them belong to her. She just has, like, a million of them. Like, literally a million of them. And she also likes to make accounts as, like, of men and, like, try to catfish me. Like, it's really weird. It's like, I'm not going to talk to some random boy that hits me up on Instagram. But anyway, this is the point. Um, She's also a very mean girl. She likes to also catfish as my, my daughter's father, sorry, and, like, text girls and tell them to, like, kill themselves and that they're ugly, like, whores and sluts and, like, all of this, like, awful stuff. She also likes to tell me, like, how she's happy about what happened to Maddie and Kaylee um tells me to kill myself calls me all these names like she's a very mean girl and i would like never make a big deal out of something that wasn't but this has gone on for like far too long and she knows she can get away with it so she continues to do it she also likes to send people her nudes and claim that they're mine which we have completely different body types so it's not like anyone believes it but it's like girl you're 14 sending people pictures of yourself Claiming that they're me for one, but for two, where are your parents? Like, what are you doing? I guess she doesn't really have parents from people at her school, like, what they've told me. Like, I guess she has a really rough childhood. But I will post the screenshots. I have so many times, so many times, been so polite, so nice, been like, I'm so sorry that you were, you know, born into the situation. I'm so sorry for the situation you're in, but it's not okay to be doing this stuff. And she just, like, doesn't care. She's just rude. Like, she, like, kindness gets nowhere with her. Anyway, I'm just asking if anyone has any ideas to get this to stop. Because, like, obviously I can live with it. I've lived with it for forever now. But it's really frustrating and really annoying when she wants to DM me and harass me every single day. And I block her. And then next thing I know, here's another account on facebook instagram snapchat tiktok she has them all so yes if anyone knows of any way to help me that would be so great thank you so much